Telecommunications in the Philippines are well developed due to the presence of modern infrastructure facilities. The industry was deregulated in 1995, leading to the creation of many telecommunication service providers for mobile, fixed line, internet and other services. Facts and figures Telephones Telephones, main lines in use 6.782 million 2011 9 international gateways, satellite earth stations 3 Intelsat, 1 Indian Ocean and 2 Pacific Ocean, submarine cables to Hong Kong, Guam, Singapore, Taiwan, and Japan. Mobile Sims in use 103 million 2012 mobile prefixes used Mobile numbers are coded base on network providers ranging from 0800 to 0999, an international code for Philippines replace the zero to make an international call to the Philippines that would make it plus 63800 to plus 63999. Radio and television Radio broadcast stations AM 369, FM 583, Shortwave 5, 2003, radios 11.5 million, 1997, television broadcast stations 233 plus 1373 CATV networks televisions 3.7 billion, 2018 Internet Internet Service Providers ISPs 320 2011 Internet Users 30 million 2011 Country Code Top Level Domain PH Area Codes Republic Acts Affecting Telecommunications August 10, 1963, Republic Act No. 3846, an act providing for the regulation of radio stations and radio communications in the Philippine Islands, and for other purposes. December 21, 1989, Republic Act No. 6849, an act providing for the installation, operation and maintenance of public telephones in each and every municipality in the Philippines, appropriating funds therefore and for other purposes. March 1, 1995, Republic Act No. 7925, an act to promote and govern the development of Philippine telecommunications and the delivery of public telecommunications services. 2016, Republic Act No. 10844, an act creating the Department of Information and Communications Technology DICT, defining its powers and functions appropriating funds thereof, and for other purposes. SMS SMS services are very common in the Philippines, from news briefs to multimedia services. Civilian logistical communication through SMS was an important part of the EDSA-2 revolt in 2001 that overthrew the government of President Joseph Estrada. Calling to the Philippines a lot of Filipinos work outside of their country and they keep contact with their families back home using calling cards to the Philippines because those are cheaper than direct calling. Some people use email or instant messaging, but the preferred method is still the phone. Telecommunications Regulatory Environment in the Philippines Lernasia's Telecommunications Regulatory Environment Trade Index, which summarizes stakeholders' perception on certain trade dimensions, provides insight into how conducive the environment is for further development and progress. The most recent survey was conducted in July 2008 in eight Asian countries, including Bangladesh, India, Indonesia, Sri Lanka, Maldives, Pakistan, Thailand, and the Philippines. The tool measured seven dimensions, I, market entry, E, access to scarce resources, E, interconnection, I, V, tariff regulation, V, anti-competitive practices, and V, universal services, V, quality of service, for the fixed, mobile and broadband sectors. See also 
National Telecommunications Commission Notes References External links National Telecommunications Commission